Welcome to Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. Make your mark. I'm Dave Palumbo, and today is Wednesday, April 20th, 2016. And let's find out what's going on in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. The road to the Toronto Pro has officially begun for the one and only Fred Biggie Smalls. Earlier this week, Smalls released footage from a recent chest training session, giving his fans a sneak peek at what he's doing to bring his best to the Queen City. Last year, Smalls brought one of his better looks of the season into Toronto and ended up finishing third behind a surging Johnny Jackson and eventual winner Brandon Curry. The former NPC national champ has done a really nice job of making improvements each and every year since he turned pro. And with a little fine tuning here and there and the right sort of conditioning, this Fred Biggie Smalls will be right in contention for the victory. Beast Mode has officially been activated for men's physique star Ryan Terry. After finishing fourth in a uber competitive men's physique division back at the Arnold Classic, Terry has gone back to the drawing board and somehow managed to add even more detail to a physique that has quickly become the very best in the sport. It's been fascinating to watch Terry transform into a little known competitor from the UK into someone who many believe to be a future Mr. Olympia candidate. If he keeps making the sort of improvements that we've seen over the last two seasons, it seems like it'll be only a matter of time before he becomes the division's number one contender. We're still about 13 weeks away from getting the party started down at the NPC Masters Nationals, but that doesn't seem to be slowing down Eric Jones. The former Mr. South Carolina overall champ announced that he's decided to cross over to the Classic Physique Division after battling it out for over a decade with the Cedric McMillans of the world, down in the home of the Gamecocks. Jones told Muscle in the Morning that he's planning to bring in a completely shredded 215 pound look to the stage as he attempts to finally bring home a pro card that's been more than two decades in the waiting. With the sort of conditioning that he's sporting right now, all Jones has to do is cruise the ship right into the harbor. And if he brings his physique in just right, he could very well be raising anchor and leaving port with a pro card in hand. This summer, the USA Championships are set to rock Sin City one more time. And last year's NPC Atlantic States middleweight champ, Vlad Petrick, is hoping to have something to celebrate about. This week, Petrick released his first official progress photos, just over 15 weeks out from making his second run at a pro qualifier. And this time around, he's all business. Last year, a much improved Petrick showed up and put on an impressive showing at the NPC Junior Nationals on his way to collecting a close second place finish. And now that he's had an entire offseason to make improvements and reformulate his plan of attack, he seems more poised than ever to put the final nail in the coffin of his amateur career. Conditioning is what's going to carry him to the win in Vegas, and if he can nail that spot on, he's going to be one tough man to beat. After a long and arduous road to make her way to a pro stage, Felicia Murray is now T-3 weeks away from making her official IFBB Pro debut. After years of grinding her way up the ladder, last year, Murray finally managed to break through at the NPC Team Universe, notching her pro card in the figure division. Earlier this week, Murray released her most recent progress photos showing off a dramatically improved physique that'll easily hold its own once the bright lights come on. And if all goes as planned, a top five placing could very well be in her future. And that does it for yet another edition of Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. Make your mark. Check out ironmaglabs.com today. I'm Dave Palumbo, reminding you to always be true to your passions. And make sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And have a happy April Fool's Day. Hey guys, it's Stevie B here. If you like what you're seeing, hit the subscribe button below and never miss another RX Muscle show, segment, or update.
RX Muscle is number one. <laughs>